Appealing the decision in Providence, we are digging deeper tonight into a story you saw first on 10. School officials don't want to allow an employee at Asa Messer Elementary to come back to work. She was put on leave a year ago after a young student left school with a man who was not approved by her family. The girl was later molested. NBC 10's Bill Rapley is live at the school department in Providence with details in the dispute. Bill? Well, Patricia, the clerk who sent that girl home last year with a relative is not at the Asa Messer Elementary School today, but she is still getting paid. Now, the school board is saying that the arbitration that came down here, they disagree with it. They're not talking about it, though. The union representing a woman also is not talking about it. The school board says that ruling was outrageous. At the Asa Messer Elementary School, it's another day of classes with little thought of the student who was allegedly molested last year by this man, Bo Kang. The school department has tried to fire the woman who released the little girl to the man she thought was her uncle. And some parents say that clerk should be fired. I agree with the school because if a person don't have the vacation, they post to the policy is you show license when you pick up a, ch a child, and they're supposed to be on the list. The school lost an arbitrator's decision last week that said the school cannot terminate the employee. Phil Keefe has been to many arbitrations. Yes, many. He's with another public sector employees union and says arbitration is usually fair. It's because the, the, the process is really simple. The school board says, quote, we are outraged by the arbitration decision that found that this inexcusable behavior did not warrant discipline. We will be appealing this decision and we'll do everything we can to terminate this employee. Keefe says if we knew all the facts, we might not agree. I think a lot of these cases where they're saying the unions are misusing their power, They'd be saying, yay, yay, yay for the unions because this person wasn't guilty, but was accused. Now, the school department says it is going to appeal the decision to Superior Court. They didn't get that appeal in today. Tomorrow's a holiday. They say legal is still working out. They also have not identified the clerk who they're trying to fire, but we went to her home today. Her family says she doesn't want to talk about it. I'm Bill Rapley, NBC 10 News at the Asa Messer Elementary School in Providence.